in a letter written by Johanna Iambo and read on her behalf at the husband's memorial service on Friday, she described her late husband as an exceptional man with a good sense of humor and said there was never a down moment between the two of them. She wiped away tears as the letter was read during the memorial service held at Parliament Gardens in Windhoek. My heart is broken losing you. You did not go alone. A part of me went with you. She said the late Iyambo taught her patience, guided her and never left her side. We shared a special love of peace, understanding, gentleness and calmness. The former vice president's son, Haga Iyambo, also paid tribute to his father. Iyambo, who is named after President Haga Kenko, said... Our father and grandfather, Dr. Nikki Iyambo, was a man who greatly impacted the lives of so many. He was more than just an inspiration to us, but an ideal to which we should all live up to. The former minister's friends described him as a personal cheerleader who was honest and honorable. Let us keep close to each other. Comrade Nikki is so alive in every single one of us. And between us, we have so many amazing memories to share. He was a good and perfect gift from above.